Now, unless you were one of the first students to make it through this class, there were probably a lot of uh, responses in that thread. And in this question, you're really going to uh, take advantage of the form. And the way you're going to do that, well, let's write it as a flow. First, you're going to find somebody else's response to the previous question. But when you do this, make sure that you don't read the review or anything but the name of the app to begin with. Because the second step is to form your own opinion about this app. What do you like about it? What do you dislike? What would you change? Once you've figured these answers out for yourself, you can go on to step three, which is actually to take a look at this other student's Prezi. You'll learn what they didn't like about this particular app and how they would fix it. Finally, you'll respond. Just in that same thread, you'll respond to the post that this other student has made. And this is the part where you have to make sure to be productive. Nobody is wrong in these situations. Different people like different things. In fact, in the next lesson, we're going to learn that even though good, or good, can differ between users, we still have systems and techniques that we can use to ensure the products we build will be good for our intended audience.